Greetings, my golden friends. Today we have another episode from Belarus. And today's topic is very important. It's about the music. And many of you enjoy and love music. But maybe not all of you know about music has been used as a weapon. So many aspects of this reality on Earth have been weaponized against us, including food. You're probably aware that food can be used as a weapon to allow your body slowly deteriorate and get sick same thing with music <clears throat> so i'm going to share my old video uh, but it's some updates and some interesting solutions to the problems uh, according with the music so and also going to be a joke so mm -hmm. prepare so please share this video because it's very important many people do not understand and do not know uh, about this uh, explanation that it connects music with math with geometry and your physical body which is if you look at your physical body you see a lot of roundness you know it's wholeness it's a lot of circles your eyeballs a circle your head you know although they're trying to put the square hat when you finish the university but <clears throat> we're still rounded we're still um, circular so let's go into the image first let's go and see the picture of the circle so some of you probably do not know about it but circle no matter how many times you divide it it adds up to number nine so look at this picture and of course i don't have perfect picture for it but we're going to explain so 360 degrees right in a circle so when you add up the numbers into single digit three plus six plus zero you get nine if you cut the 316 into half you get 180 one plus eight plus zero is nine right then you cut in half 90 degrees number nine cut in half 45 degrees four plus five is nine do it again 22.5 two plus two plus five is nine again right then you cut in half 11 point one plus one plus two plus five again is nine and you can get a calculator and go into you know details it's gonna always come up to number nine so number nine is very sacred so now we're gonna connect the the roundness of our physical body which is a lot of circles right all the organs within the circle even the cells they are not square they kind of rounded you know they everything is kind of cohesive and round so same thing with music music is supposed to be written on a positive scale uh, holiness holy scale which is 432 degrees so let's go to another picture and here we are so you see the comparison of two frequencies and there are different notes c d e f g a b right do re mi fa so le si so you have all the scale frequencies so the note a nota la la note la a it could be either 440 which is negative or 432 which is positive frequency so i have a smaller picture which is compares to just from this same picture but it's uh, right next to each other these two frequencies and one I just added up number nine because it was just easy to put um, equals number nine so but you can do it yourself uh, if you add up all the numbers in the frequency of 440 you get chaos and I've done it so here's my page so you can pause the video and take a look at it so when you add up all the numbers to a single digit you get you know either chaos or balance number nine so 432 is a sacred frequency so this is kind of mathematical explanation why should we listen to the music on a scale of 432 hertz and there are a lot of people who are awakening to this truth now so you can find a lot of music that is already written produced and sold on this positive frequency but um, some people do not know even the artists themselves they are still performing not knowing 
this um, truth and not knowing it doesn't mean you know you cannot do something about it so knowledge is power and that's why we have this joke now so imagine the situation this strong muscle guy comes up to, comes into the store and he's asking for a chainsaw so he looks at different kinds of chainsaw the salesperson shows him different kinds and and he agrees to buy this one and he's like do you have a manual for this like, yeah here's a blue book so take a look at this blue book he, he looks at the manual he's like, okay i'll buy this one and uh, he goes home and after a few weeks he returns it and he's like i'm i have to return it it doesn't work according to the manual and the salesperson like why well it says that within one hour you can put down 10 trees and no matter how hard i try i can only do nine and the salesperson like frazzled like mm, i don't understand this like it should be definitely working so he's looking at the menu he's looking at his blue book and asking questions like, like excuse me sir uh what kind of gasoline are you putting into it and the muscle guy's like what do you mean you have to put gasoline in it <laughs> so that's that's a joke <laughs> what do you mean <laughs> and that reminds me of the movie um do you remember the movie greek wedding my big fat greek wedding it was a guy and i think it's a it's um like tv has been weaponized definitely you know they use tv as a weapon to target all sorts of um conspiracies all sorts of um, good and positive things to make them reverse so in this movie my big fat greek wedding the guy was i think vegetarian and it was uh, some kind of celebration and this lady greek lady loud says what do you mean you don't eat no meat and the music stops everybody's like looking like crazy oh okay i'll make you lamb so they make a fun of this guy just like he's you know he's an idiot for not eating meat by the way i get a lot of this uh comments here as well in my small town of belarus so people think just because you don't eat no meat uh, <laughs> you, you somehow you are lacking something you know um, you have to know exactly how to feed yourself if you don't eat meat but um, this video is not about it but let's go let's go back what we can do about this chaos that is all around us so most of the music on TV and radio it's on a negative frequency unfortunately 440 Hertz and it creates all sorts of diseases it creates depression it makes you feel tired and sick because it doesn't vibrate inside your body properly it gives you that chaos that chaos and confusion just like the numbers you see it's when they add up it's not the same digit so number nine so if you do have music already stored on your computer i i can help you right now but if it's on a cell phone i'm not sure but there are programs that you can probably download so i recommend for the computers there is a free program audacity so here's a little banner for it and um yeah you can download this program and then now i'm going to show you how to change the existing song into positive frequency but before we do that i'm going to also share my experience with classical music because Classical music is one of the best um, melodies to um, to relax, to f make you feel good. And um, there is a organ classical music. And uh, I think most of the organ music is already in 432 positive frequency because when they went, like it was years and years ago, when they went and changed the whole world into this negative frequency of 440, hertz um organs are so huge and so expensive to make they did they decided not to touch them just let them be and uh, all music that is played on the organ it's already on 432 more than likely at least what i've found in my experience so don't ex don't uh, just think that everything is already in negative frequency don't be discouraged but test it so what i do i tune my guitar to a positive frequency of 432 hertz so i have this device here 
I'm not advertising it. There are so many of them, but you can see at the base it's 432 hertz, right? And this can be changed. This device can be changed to any kind of frequency. So when my guitar is tuned to this positive frequency, when I listen to the song that I, I want to test, if I want to save it, if it's in a positive or negative frequency, I will play the melody along the lines and just hear because I, I do have good ears and I will hear if there's a difference because it's a very slight difference, only 8 hertz. It's a very tiny minute difference, but it makes a whole lot of difference. So when I test the song and I know that it has to be changed, I, I go to the Audacity program and I change it this way. So let me activate the uh, program. Okay, so now we are... Okay, I think I've done it correctly. So as you can see the screen, so this is empty screen of Audacity. So to open up the new song that you want to work with, you go into the first file, you click open, then you find the song within your folders, and then you click open it. I'm, I'm sorry, it's in Russian language, but you click open. So it transfers the song into Audacity. And when you have the song here, you click it twice with the left mouse, you highlight it, and then you go into Effect. So at the very top, you go down to Effect, and then inside the Effect, you go into Change Pitch. Okay, and then here now you see Frequency from 2. So from, you highlight and put 440. And in my case, it automatically goes to 432. Okay, so from 440 to 432 hertz. And then you press OK. It will take a few seconds to change the pitch of the whole song, so you don't have to struggle. And but now you have to extract it into your other folder. So you go into File, you press Export, Export as MP3. And then you find the folder that you want to go into. And I usually put 